five armed robberies within just an hour this morning. Yeah, this comes just a day after we reported several 7-Elevens were robbed. CBS 2's Asal Razai is live at one of those robbery scenes in Bucktown. Hey, Asal. Hey guys, so this all happened between 4 and 5 o'clock this morning. I want to show you a map to give you a better idea of how, apart, how far apart rather these robberies are. You can see all across the west side and all very close to each other in adjacent neighborhoods. Now the last armed robbery happened right here on Levitt and North Avenue at 5 o'clock this morning. The suspects in a gray sedan were told by police pushing a 22-year-old man to the ground and taking his belongings. This would be one of five robberies. The first one happening at four o'clock this morning in the 700 block of Jackson. That's where a lot of people are getting off the train. There, a 57 year old and a 51 year old man were stopped when four suspects got out of a car waving a gun and demanding their belongings. One of the men was hit in the face by one of those suspects. Then 20 minutes later, the same car description, four suspects took down a 60 nine-year-old man in the 800 block of North Walcott taking his belongings at gunpoint. Then they moved further to where they hit two locations in just 10 minutes, guys. Two different places on North Tallman. There are the suspects robbing two separate victims that were sitting inside of their cars. They again got away with money and some personal belongings. Now, right now, there is no indication that any surveillance cameras in this area that I'm in were able to catch any video or any uh, stills of that car fleeing. But we do know that Chicago police are staying on top of this and investigating multiple crime scenes. I'm live in Bucktown. That's all reside. CBS 2 News.